Hello and thank you so much for taking the time to watch my video. Um, this video is all about um, is all about perfection and about how I believe a lot of people, um, including myself at times, um, allow perfection to hold us back. I think if you're in business or if you're just looking to improve your life or whatever it is you're trying to do, I think perfection is something which we need to stop aiming for. Now there's going to be some people that are watching this video that think, well hold on a minute mate, if you want to do well you've obviously got to be the best at what you can uh, obviously try to do. And I kind of partly agree with that. But it shouldn't stop you from starting. The trouble with a lot of people, they procrastinate and they think, they overthink what it is they're going to do and they end up doing nothing. They end up thinking, oh no, it might it might cost me too much money or perhaps it won't work or perhaps I haven't perfected uh, what it is I want to obviously promote. Yeah, You need to realise that um, perfection is really, really hard to achieve. And in some cases, perhaps in like my case with um, doing personal development, it's almost impossible, impossible to achieve because there's no real way of actually measuring your achievement yeah so you need to consider this when you when you think about um, am I gonna do this thing am I gonna go ahead and try it um, am I ready to do it yet you need to remember that aiming, perf aiming for perfection is only gonna hold you back and I don't think it's the, it's the way to be we obviously want to be good and obviously get better become more skillful uh, um, at whatever it is we're trying to achieve but we shouldn't stop ourselves from doing it in the first place um, when I talk about perfection you know I could even think about my channel when I first started YouTube when I first started putting some videos up um, I was worried about how I looked and and I was oh and I was even though I'm, I'm, I'm the kind of guy that generally does um, normally just go for things I was still being critical and worrying about whether or not I was going to get views, whether or not people were going to click off. I was kind of overthinking it. But it wasn't until I watched some other videos um, on perfection and, and I watched some other YouTubers that were saying you've just got to start putting your content out there and letting your audience decide that, that it made me realise that perfection, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter, at least not in the first instance. Instance, yeah. So, like with my channel now, um, um, I watch some of my own videos now, and I think my videos are getting obviously better than, than the ones when I first started. I've got a lot more confidence now in front of the camera. Obviously, my audience, um, you know, will be the real ones if you like that make that decision. But it's if I'd not if I decided to try and um, be perhaps as good as I am today making a video, I probably would have never got here because I've had to go through the process of of trying to learn how to talk, how to position myself and different things. Um, I've had to go through all the videos I've made before to obviously try and learn and become better at doing them now. So the whole idea of this video um, um, is to make you realise that perfection it's not the be all and end all um, of obviously um, everything in your life. Yeah, if there's something you want to try and do and you're not sure it's going to work, obviously be careful about spending loads of money on it. I'd be very careful before I dove it, uh, uh, dived in and spent loads of money on a business. But I think it's a good idea to test the water. It's a good idea to you know put yourself out there and not worry, not worry about this perfection. Yeah. Then even if you were brilliant, yeah, I've watched other YouTubers uh, who do um, who, who do personal development, um, who got big you know big channels on YouTube, and they they talk about this subject of perfection, and they say even now when they've reached this high level, this high level of knowledge, yeah, you know, they know about every single subject, they still say in their videos that they're still learning, they're still growing. Yeah, and they still say that even now when they've reached this level of expertise, they've still got these people who leave negative um, negative comments and who pull them down. We're always going to have critics. There's always going to be someone 
uh, somebody negative, Mr. Negative, who's going to pull you down. And it might be that because of this, that you're worried, you're so worried about negative comments that you're worried about what people are going to say about you. You're worrying about whether people um, are going to say you're wasting your time or, or whatever it is. You need to step aside from these people and realise that they don't control your life. You control your own life. You control your own destiny. And this perfection thing, this trying to be the best, you're not going to get anywhere near it unless you start doing it. It's only by doing more and more and more, yeah, will you become the person that you want to be. You know, a typical example, I don't play golf, but a typical example would be somebody who's trying to play golf. You know, if they went out the first day and they tried to pot a ball or tried to tee off, and they'd, they'd probably make a right, um, right, you know, right uh, mistake. You know, obviously the, yeah, the ball would go the wrong way, everything would, would be wrong for them. Their grip would be wrong. Everything would be wrong. But perfection, becoming better at playing that sport, becoming better at talking to people, becoming better when you're in an interview, becoming better at um, selling, becoming better at driving, whatever it is you want to become better at, this perfection won't happen unless you put your toe in the water and you try and do it and you do it daily. Yeah? For me, um, like I say, well, I go back to my channel on YouTube. Um, you know, obviously, you, you look at your analytics, people watching your videos, and you can see when they when they stay on, when they click off. And I'm trying to see, you know, what's obviously holding people's attention. I'm trying to learn. You're learning all the time, and only by doing these things and making mistakes and having people give you negative comments, or not so much negative comments, but people give you giving you constructive criticism do you learn and do you get that that much that much nearer to being um a perfectionist or being an ex expert at what you do but i honestly don't think that anyone even the greatest person at whatever it is in the world they are still not at perfection because they can still do something better yeah to get that little bit further. So, you know, the brunks of this story is, the brunks of this video, which I'm guessing you've, if you're still watching it, you've obviously, um, the pennies dropped and you've realized that you've just got to do it. Yeah? Stop worrying about perfection and stop worrying about criticism. Yeah? You're always gonna have someone who give you a negative comment. Don't worry about it, yeah? Just say to yourself, next. If someone, I, I do marketing and sometimes I meet these people, these, these what I call clever people, and they and they try and act, you know, act like they know more about um, perhaps what I'm selling than what I do. And them sort of people, I just, I do, I just brush past them because I just don't want to be around them. I just don't want to be around these people that are going to hold me back who or, or who try and act like they're above me. I just go next. Yeah, I don't let them win don't give them the time yeah your time is precious if you're like me i don't know what your job is but for me for me and for a lot of working class people time is money time is money if you don't do something if you're if you're thinking oh perhaps i i should do it but i won't do that yeah you're and and you you know in your own mind if it's possibly a good idea don't let that opportunity pass you by why would you let that opportunity pass you by? Don't listen to negative people that are making comments um, about what you're doing when they've got no expertise in it anyway. Yeah, I spoke about that in another video, how sometimes people will have their say about something which you might be planning on doing, but they don't, um, they've got no expertise in it. So how is their opinion of any importance? It's not. It's only important if you allow it to take over your mind and to sow that negative seed in your mind. Don't let these people drop these negative seeds in your mind. Move away, yeah? Move away, yeah? If it was raining, you'd get in out of the rain. It's exactly the same with negative people. If they're putting negativity, if they're blocking your ideas, if they're blocking your your um, your dream, 
you need to push them away. And with this expertise love, this expertise thing, you need to realize that it doesn't matter if you're an expert. You can still have your say, you can still try and do something. If it don't work, why? Right, keep trying, yeah? Keep trying. Don't let these, these, um, these people um, make you think that you can't achieve because any, anybody can achieve. Everyone can achieve. All, all it comes down to is your mindset. It comes down to your daily plan of action. It obviously comes down to opportunity. Sometimes it comes down to having the money to be able to do, do whatever it is you want to do, right? But you can always achieve, yeah? You can always achieve, yeah? A person can wake up in the morning and they feel a bit dodgy, you know, they feel a, you know, a little bit negged out and they might think, I ain't going to get out of bed today, yeah? But if you get out of bed, you're, you've already achieved something because you've got out of bed and you're now going to fill your day, yeah? So every single day you're achieving things. The amount you achieve is, um, in my mind, is totally dependent on the length of your day. What you achieve is dependent upon the length of your day and how you've structured your day and how you've decided to take actions with the tasks for you to achieve more in your day, yeah? Because if you write something down, what you're gonna do, and you and you actually go ahead and do it, well then you've achieved, yeah? If you write something down and you don't do it, then you've not achieved. You only blame one person for that, it's you, yeah? It might be that you've been distracted, it might be that something else that somebody else thinks might think's more important than what you were going to do. Well, I've done another video that a video on that about distraction. Yeah, you need to realise that your day is your day; it's nobody else's. So when people try and make out that um, this thing that they want you to do for them is more important, say to yourself, "No, this is important. It's important that I do this today. I'm going to do this first. Yeah. So. I'm going to end the video now, but just think about what I've said. Concentrate on not worrying 100% about being a perfectionist, because it really don't matter. What does matter? To me, especially in my job, I do sales and marketing, what matters in my job daily is action. Yeah? He who dares, if you like, as, um, as a, um, only falls and horses, he who dares, yeah, wins. And it's true. You need to be putting yourself out there, doing whatever it is what that you know what you what you want to do, and persevering at it, persevering at it, and then great things will happen for you. Yeah. My channel is called Colin Talks. Um, you can also um, get a direct link to my channel, ColinTalks.co.uk. I'm also on Facebook, so please try and find me on Facebook. Again, I'm under Colin uh, Colin Talks. Um, please add me as a friend, and I'll and I'll be happy to um, obviously um, friend you back. And uh, um, I really appreciate it. I'm trying to obviously build my business on YouTube, build my channel. I'd really appreciate it if you subscribe to my channel and leave a um, leave a comment. And please like my video. And if you there's a little notification bell. If you click on that, you'll be notified when I bring out another video. If you did watch to the end, I'd really do generally appreciate your view. And I hope that whatever it is you're thinking about doing, whatever little, you know, whatever it is that you've you've kind of got in your head that you want to do, stop aiming for, for perfection and just do it, yeah. Because the critics will be there, whether you're whether you're the best at it or not. There's always going to be people that will bring you down. Don't let them. Focus on what you want to do, yeah. Be in control of your life, of your destiny. Don't let anybody else map out your life do it yourself yeah because you can do it um if you see my other videos i talk about how i've been doing personal development for a couple of years now and it definitely helps it definitely makes you focus more on what you want to achieve focus more on your days ahead and it gives you a goal and for me as well it gives me inspiration yeah inspiration and motivation yeah that is the key and also um, which I spoke about in another video, is having your reason why. You need to focus daily on why you want to achieve more. Who, you know, what's making you do it? Is it your family? You know, do you want a nicer home? What is the reason?
Because all these things that you're focusing on, yeah, will make you do more and will make you become more. Thanks for watching my video. Like I say, please like, please subscribe and um, add me on Facebook. Thank you so much.